Well, good evening, everybody. This is WBKB meteorologist Ryan Crump. I hope you all having a good evening so far. Again, we saw a few breaks of sun in the morning hours. Other than that, we just experienced cloudy skies. Thanks to, again, some lake effect clouds uh, being blown in off of Lake Huron today. That kept our skies mostly cloudy. If you're further inland, you saw a little bit more sunshine in the area. I expect more sunshine as we go through your day on your Tuesday, and even to your Wednesday. And temperatures are definitely going to respond to that. I'll show you the seven day forecast in just a moment. We're going to talk about some record breaking temperatures, especially for Thursday and Friday here, guys. Again, as I just as you see here, mild temperatures will be continuing as we go through your day on your Tuesday. Now we will see a change. We will see changes, especially as we go through the end of this weekend into early next week. And I'll show you that on my seven day forecast. And again, possible record breaking temperatures here, guys. We were talking about close to 60 degrees in terms of our temperatures here, guys. Close to 60 in some spots. Now, of course, going back to 1966, uh, we got up to 52 degrees. That could possibly fall as we go through your day on your Friday. I'll show you that on seven day forecast, but it's worth a price. We're going to see some rain showers in the area on our Thursday and Friday as well. So again, Alpena saw a high temperature of 38 degrees today, guys. 38, that's 10 degrees above average. Again, 27 was the overnight low. 48 was the record high back in 2005. Negative 27 was the record low back in 1918. Sunrise is at 7.48 a.m. on sunset at 5.48 p.m. Days are getting longer, guys, so that's going to definitely help in terms of our temperatures. Now, of course, 27 degrees is going to be our temperature to start off the day on our Tuesday. Again, a little bit of patchy fog will be in the four forecast again so be careful if you are going out to school or just going to work because again visibility could be a little bit of an issue 44 degrees is going to be our temperature as we go throughout the day here guys 34 will actually be where we stand as we go through the evening hours so temperatures again going to start out in the 20s as we go throughout your day morning hours we go warm up to the 40s so a little bit more sunshine that's going to help warm our temperatures up just a little bit more and then even better as we go through the out the course of the week we're going to be talking about record breaking temperatures especially thursday and friday friday is my particular day here guys because i got a forecast of mid to upper 50s for highs here guys our average high for this time of year is 28 degrees we're going to be well above that even our overnight lows are going to be well above average for this time of the year now of course according to the temperature outlook we're talking about well above average temperatures this is ranging all the way from the from the, uh, montana all the way through across the uh, eastern part of the country the upper midwest parts of the uh, carolinas through the northeast and of course, you notice that blue that's out there in parts of the Rockies in the Pacific. That cold air will eventually make it in our direction here, guys, as we go through the early part of next week. And I'll show you that also in my seven day forecast. Now, again, like I said, we saw clouds today. That's thanks to the winds coming out of the north and basically bringing us some lake effect clouds as we went throughout the day today. So, yes, we didn't see as much sunshine over here. But again, if you was further inland, we saw more sunshine in our area in their area so again I expect more as we go throughout the course of the day on your Tuesday so again we're not gonna see a whole lot in the way of rain or even snow showers as we go throughout the day I have to say rain because we are temperatures are warm enough to see rain and not necessarily snow but you notice that we're gonna see again cloud cover from time to time but rain showers begin to develop as we go through your day on your Thursday it could bring us some rain chances especially late on your day on your Thursday so something you need to keep in mind so again tonight we're gonna see mostly cloudy skies patchy fog cannot be ruled out in some of our uh, areas Temperatures are going to be about 28 degrees in Roger C, 25 in Alpine, 25 in Osco, 27 in Taiwan, and 24 in Mile. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies. Again, some patchy fog early in the day. High temperatures are going to be about 40 degrees. 43 in uh, Onaway, 43 in Atlanta, 42 in Alpine, 40 in Roger City, 40 in Osco, 38 in Taiwan, 39 in Harrisville. So, again, guys, take a look at these temperatures. We're talking about well above average temperatures. 44 on Tuesday, 48 on Wednesday, 54 on Thursday. You think this is good? Take a look at Friday. Friday, we're talking about 57 degrees and record-breaking temperatures are possible. I wouldn't even rule out Thursday as having a possible record-breaking temperature. Saturday, we're going to still be well, be a well above average. But then as you go through early next week, we will see temperatures drop back off to where they should be for this time of the year. 27 degrees on our Monday here, guys. Again, look at the overnight lows. We're talking about 40 degrees for Thursday, 36 on Friday, 33 on Saturday. This is above average even for a high temperature 
for this time of the year. So enjoy the warmer temperatures while we still could because again, as you might notice on Monday, we're gonna be right back to where we should be for this time of the year. Well, this has been WBKB meteorologist Ryan Crump. I hope you all have a good evening.